guys, this is Aiden's Toy Trove. I'm here today with my Briar 2017 Stablemate Club Allegiance. This is the Rivet Mo Mold, which was sculpted by Jane Lunger. I'm sorry, Jane, if I just slaughtered your name. I'm sure I did. And he is a clear wear, um, red, white, and blue. So he's very much like um, the traditional scale Briar Patriot who was produced a few years ago. And I do have a Patriot here, so I will compare him to Patriot for you so that you can have a look. Uh, again, this is a clear wear, so if you um, put him up against the sunlight or light, it will shine through and he will look super, super pretty. So this is how they're packaged in a box with um, paper on top to keep them from bouncing the box. And then they are inside a kind of a, a thicker plastic bag and it has the name and the number. The Stablemate Club models are all in a blue pouch. Um, it's different for the uh, the Premier Club Stablemate and the Vintage Club Stablemate who come in different color pouches. Um, so they do keep those very unique. And I really love these little, they're kind of a silky uh, texture. And then they have uh, Briar 2017 Stablemate Club in gold ink on the front of the pouch. And then they tie them in super neat little bow knots. And I try to imitate the bow knot, but I never get it quite as nice as uh, it comes. But I try. Okay, so inside the little uh, Briar Stimulate Club bag is a, um, a little kind of bu like bubble pouch. Um, and this is the cheaper bubble wrap. Uh, it's usually kind of fairly popped. Um, so it doesn't provide all that much protection, but added with the bag, um, it's enough. And then in, let's see, this is a little plastic bubble wrap pouch. And then inside the bubble wrap pouch is another clear plastic bag. This one is smaller and more form fitted to the horse than the outer bag that has the, uh, the sticker and the product number of the horse. And this one is taped shut as well. And the trick is going to be finding the end of the tape. Hmm. I really like this mold. He is fun. He seems to be very popular. Um, and I like him myself. Right now, I think he uh, has a current release as a, uh, a roan. I believe it's a roan, and he's released as the Mustang. And, um... I can't believe it. I can't find the end of this silly piece of tape. I think it's kind of in this seam. You know, I don't want to rip this bag up, so I'm just going to opt to cut it. Um, this morning, I could not find my razor, which um, sometimes makes the opening horses easier. But I could not find it. Okay, so here we have, this is Allegiance. And he's a 2017 Stablemate Club model. Um, as you can see, he's kind of translucent, um, like all translucent models. You can see some bubbles inside him, so if you look carefully, there's a big, big bubble in his belly, which actually, because of his color, isn't very obvious at all. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but if you look right there in the center of his belly, um, there's the big bubble. But I don't find that distracting, and it's something that all the translucent models have, so it's um, a very frequent flaw if you would even call it a flaw so he is a blue color he has red on his legs and he has red on his muzzle and then his little socks are um it almost looks like he has clear socks and then blue on his hooves so really pretty and they might be they might be clear feet altogether and i'm just catching um kind of some um shining or glare from his blue plastic on his feet i'm not sure but this is allegiance and he's actually quite nice um i really did not like briar stock photo of him uh, but in person he's actually kind of cool i do like briar's clear wear horses a lot um so i guess it's not a big surprise to me that i like him more in person than i did in the stock photo uh, if you look closely here, he's got stars in his pattern, and this is much more apparent when um, you have light shining through them. Um, one of Briar's latest clear wares is Sugar Maple, 
the sugar maple is on the, sh the uh, show jumping warm blood mold and has an autumn leaf pattern and unfortunately we did not receive our shipment of sugar maples i did purchase um, some at retail price um, because i wanted one for uh, my own collection but we did not receive those from briar unfortunately okay so that is allegiance um, let me get this out of the way and i will show you patriot So this is Patriot, Allegiance's uh, big brother. He is the Kathleen Moody Clock Horse Mold. Uh, and he's a really super awesome. Um, and this is, was the first time that Briar used this this patriotic um, blue, red, red, white, and blue theme. He also has stars on his um, body. I don't know if you can see them. Again, this is another one of those models where um, he shows much, much better um, in uh, bright light, and it's really overcast here, and the box is just showing you lots and lots of glare, uh, so I apologize for that. And then uh, Patriot, just in case you were wondering, he was limited to 3,000 pieces, and it says so here on the back of the box. So I will go ahead and put um mr allegiance up here next to patriot so that you can compare the two for yourselves and let me see if i can just adjust the camera a little teeny weeny bit there we go because patriot is super super tall so there we have patriot and here we have allegiance his little brother aren't they cute i wish the light was better uh i did not drag out my photo light to put over the table so this is just my kitchen light which is rather dim and it is raining and dreary and yicky outside so uh, there's no sunlight shining in but I will get some photos of this guy um, in my photo tent that will hopefully show um, the translucent qualities to his color a bit more than this so again this is the Brower 2017 stable Mate club model allegiance and this is his big brother Patriot who was released a couple years ago um, as a um, uh, I want to say a spring special run, but it might have been something else. Thanks for watching.